Hi, my name is Janice Pullen. I'm an elementary school teacher and I work with small groups of students as a reading and math specialist. Today I'd like to show you three games used for learning to tell time. The materials that you'll need for these games are a teaching clock with movable hands and a small clock for each student. We'll also need some little cards that have drawings of the analog time with a matching digital time. And finally, you'll need a sheet of paper with a grid on it for a game called My TV Guide. The first game is called Guess My Time. In this game, the teacher tells the student, my hour hand is on the four, my minute hand is on the two. The students make that clock on their small clocks and then tell you what time it is. We'll check with them to make sure they have the same um, spots with their hour hand and minute hand and then they tell the time. You could call out a little more challenging times like 5.30. Ask them to make it and then turn it around and show you. Also include noon or midnight, a quarter after a certain hour. An advanced version would be to use elapsed time. You could say, it is 7 o'clock right now. What time will it be in one and a half hours? Let them make that on their clock and then check it. Another fun game is the classic game concentration. You will have these pre-made little cards with an analog drawing of a time and then a matching digital time. Spread these out over your table and take turns trying to make matches. The students get a chance for a lot of practice using this game. And the final game or activity is called My TV Guide. Using this grid, the student is asked to write in their favorite shows, the day that it's on, the channel and time, and in the final column, draw a small clock with that time represented. I hope you'll use some of these games for teaching time to students.